Yo, what's up, Pride Nation? Back at you with another one on today. I am your main man, TA of Noble Sports Entertainment. If you have not subscribed to this channel, then what are you waiting for? Because we talk sports, period. All right, guys, without further ado, I want to talk about rookie running back out of Detroit. And that is no other than Ty Johnson. So let's go ahead and get into this installment. Pretty much, guys, um, if you don't know, if you've been living under a rock, Ty Johnson has been balling out in the OTAs. He has doing, been doing an exceptional great job in the mini camp with the uh, special teams and things of that nature. And uh, just being able to do good overall with uh, running the ball. Ty Johnson has been able to display his uh, skill set, which uh, is speed. Um, one thing I learned when I was a young boy and uh, I played football, and I can, I'll never forget this. My coach said, one thing, son, that you can't teach. And I said, yeah, coach, what is that? And he said, um, you can't teach speed. And ever since then, <laughs> that has been a, a very, very true statement. And Ty Johnson definitely is our speed running back on this team. He is a guy that I would love to see paired up with Carrion Johnson to make the Johnson Express. The Johnson Express is Carrion Johnson and um, Ty Johnson becoming the two running backs in the backfield. Um, both last name Johnson both of these guys could um be stellar for us the only thing with ty johnson is that he's going to have to go through some obstacles to uh be able to make the 53 man roster uh towards uh the beginning of the season and one thing is he's going to have to show is the ability to be able to play on special teams uh that's one thing that we always need we always need guys to be able to play special teams and a guy like Ty Johnson using his speed and utilizing his speed is what's, what's going to truly keep him on this roster and what's going to really, really make the Lions decide whether or not they should keep Theo Riddick. That is a great decision coming up from the Detroit Lions that they're going to have to do as far as um, who they're going to keep. So will it be Ty Johnson? Will it be uh, um, Theo Riddick? Will it be uh, Zach Zinner? Which running backs are they going to keep? We already know that C.J. Anderson and Kerryon Johnson are our one and two punch. But uh, I would definitely like to see the youth movement go on in Detroit. That's something that I've been wanting to see for a long time. Fresh legs in the backfield. And uh, we got those fresh legs last season with Kerryon Johnson. But uh, having another young running back in the backfield with Kerryon would be an awesome thing. Especially if this guy is going to be any good. Um, as they as good as he said in, in his advertising, he's been doing good in minicamp and OTAs. You're definitely going to see this guy make the roster because you can't teach speed. And when you got speed, definitely you are going to be a vital asset to the team. You're not going to be a liability. You're going to be an asset. And I think that Ty Johnson, his biggest thing is just he just needs to learn the playbook. He, he needs to learn everything that he needs to do and excel at it especially when you get the opportunity in the preseason to uh, run the ball because you will get the opportunity. You want to take advantage of it so that you have an opportunity to make the roster. And I think that Ty Johnson will make every bit um, of this roster. I think that he has a, uh, a great shot to make this roster and his speed is what's going to carry him to be able to make this roster and be able to uh, be active on the special teams. Uh, whether it's a kick return, pump return, or um, running down on the kickoff, they're going to find a way to use this young fella's speed. And I definitely think that he has a great shot and a legitimate shot to make the team. I think that Ty Johnson is something that the Lions have needed for a long time in the backfield, and that is a guy that has speed. That's something that we you can't, you can't coach. You can't coach speed. But what you can coach is the fundamentals of the game, being able to learn the position, and hopefully he'll pick up on Daryl Bevel's offense so that he can be a, a rotational piece in the backfield um, and being used because I definitely want to see what Ty Johnson brings to the table. What will he do um, in the preseason to uh, earn his spot on the team? Because it's not going to be easy, especially if the Lions decide that they want to keep a guy like Theo Riddick. And we know um, how vital uh, Zach Zinner is to the team as well.
When Carry On went down last season, Zach Zenner pretty much was our best running back that we had. So the Lions ended up bringing him back. But this season, the Lions decided to draft another running back, and that's to bring uh, competition into the backfield. And I definitely would want to see the Johnson Express, Carry On, and Ty Johnson being able to tote that rock and being able to carve up the NFL. I would love to see it. I know you as a fan would love to see it. So let me know, guys, what you think about the Johnson Express, the youth movement, and what the Detroit Lions are trying to do with Ty Johnson. I'm out of here. Till next time. Peace. I can't eat my heart.